1990 NLCS MVP, two-time World League Relief Man of the Year, a 14-year Major League career, top 10 all-time with 347 saves. Here to present the Meritorious Service Award is former Cubs All-Star Randy Myers. Well, thanks a lot. Uh, first of all, I want to thank Tom Sheriff for putting an extra rhino for the autograph session. Because I said about five autographs, I think I signed 50. So, Rhino, thank you for having me. That's good. Uh, actually, I got to know Cher. I'll call her Pranaz probably throughout a uh, quick thing. But knew her in 92. I signed a, a deal with Chicago and came over here and picked me up at the airport. We have a mutual friend from New York and said, okay. And she goes, well, what do you need? And I go, well, let's see. We need an apartment, you know, things. Run me all around. Real nice. And all of a sudden she goes, you do like to do media interviews, don't you? I go, no. <laughs> she goes, well, what do you like to do? I go, well, I like to talk to fans and stuff, just one-on-one. -on -one. She goes, well, you like to autograph sessions? I go, no. She goes, how long do I have to deal with you? <laughs> now, Harry, uh, used to, uh, the gentleman I used to work with the Cubs for a while, Harry Carey, and Sharon used to gang up on me. Harry used to say there, stand there, and, he goes, Randy, when we get a lead, we don't like blown saves or extra inning games. Sharon, because it messes up the media guidelines and deadlines, and me, because it makes it longer for me to go get a soda after the game. So that was there. <laughs> One thing about Sharon had, uh, she was with the Cubs about 24 years, and she had the respect of Major League Baseball and among her peers. Because even though the Cubs haven't been in a World Series for a few years, they had her, they always brought her in for media with the All-Star Games, the World Series, the playoffs. And to be able to do that and come from a team that's not in it, but in it, that's a huge respect. And uh, it's a positive thing. Sharon now works at NBC, handling publicity for all East Coast entertainment productions, including limited, but not limited to, tell that, Saturday Night Live, Jimmy Fallon Show, and 30 Rock. Well, Sharon called me about three weeks ago and she said, what are you doing on the 17th? I go, hunting. She goes, well, look, I got to be, I have an opportunity to go to Chicago and receive this award. But right now, Sharon is supposed to be in Hollywood at the Golden Globes with the red carpet with 30 Rock, I'm supposed to get a presentation. She goes, what do, you, what do you want me to do? What should I do? I said, tell you what, call me. If, if you blow off Hollywood, I'll go off hunting for the weekend and I'll meet you in Chicago. <laughs> well, two days later she called and said, get your plane ticket and bring your sport jacket. So as you see, <laughs> this is my sport jacket. <laughs> so, Sharon, I'm presenting you, or you already got the award, the uh, McCarr McCarr Meritorious <laughs> Service Award. Sharon <laughs> I heard a lot of crazy stories from the other PR directors. 
And I'm like, no, they can't be true. But really, they all were. And it was the first player I ever had that actually had hand grenades in his locker. <laughs> I'd also like to uh, thank all my friends and family that are here tonight and those that couldn't be for all their love and support through the years. And uh, the game of baseball is the best. This is like being a family reunion. So thank you. <laughs>